I missed you welcome back i'm sorry it's been a hot minute since i've been here in the youtube um honestly the past few weeks i've been just um doing the same but not focusing so much on youtube i guess i've been focusing on the patreon and also my store and just myself um i talk about it a little bit after sorry at the end of the video that i was just feeling a little bit eh, or just down but not in a bad way because I always take it as an um, opportunity to just reflect on myself and how I feel and what I think about things and what's going on in the world and how it's affecting me. Anyways, this vlog is might be a little bit all over the place, <laughs> but honestly I was just filming bits and pieces here and there, um, so it might be, uh, like I said, just a little uh, of a mush. But um, yeah, like I said, I've been just um, reflecting a lot and trying to read and trying to find things to do that I really, really enjoy. Um, which I think it's drinking a lot of tea. <laughs> um, and also I'm trying always to do some workout. I don't really work out like a, like, like a proper workout. I just try to go out almost every day and then I just put on my music or I try also listening to podcasts, but honestly, I just mostly, um, listen to my music because <laughs> it just keeps me going a little bit more but it's just walking or maybe running sometimes but mainly walking and of course i have to catch up on my orders this was filmed right after i posted my draco video so i had quite a lot of orders um from uh, that print specifically but yeah so this is me just writing the little thank you note i read them by hint and even though it's a lot of work sometimes i'm like oh there's so many notes but i just love 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 seeing when you guys post stories about the prints and and just how happy it makes me feel and that makes me so happy even though i know it sounds hella cheesy and i'm sorry but as a truth so yes <laughs> i'm very 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 grateful for you guys support and being able to have a little store and uh, so I can get my prints And this is the batch of prints that I usually take to the um, um, USPS store almost every week um, I try to go. So um, yeah, let's just go and ship those prints. And this is me being uh, very cheap at the, <laughs> at the meter. <laughs> Gotta save those um, 50 cents. <laughs> And then maybe, just maybe, I'm going to also uh, check out what's in the art store. I probably don't need anything, but oh, uh, look at that radiant magenta though. And I'm constantly working on some paintings, of course, either personal or for my Patreon or commissions. Um, this one is more of a personal painting um, and I got this canvas at Michael's and the thing is that I never really paint on canvas but because I always feel like it's the texture is more rough and it's easier to paint on wood but the thing is that I want to eventually paint um, on much larger scale and you can't really do that on wood it's much easier on canvas because of transportation it's cheaper um, to move and, and easier it just makes sense why it's been used for so many years um, but I am a coward and I just like my wood panels but um, we're getting there we're getting there And 
and here I went to Air One for the third time in my life, which by the way, it's crazy expensive, oh my goodness, but I wanted to make this vegan brownies and then I found this recipe of this girl that, oh, I forgot her name, but it's so good, it's so, so, so good. Um, I wanted to make these brownies for my friend Lupe because she was having a really hard time with um, her health and um, she's vegan, so, <laughs> I, vegan or pescatarian, anyways, so I tried to make these brownies, but instead of using the normal flour like a normal person, I tried to go a little fancy and I bought this uh, Japanese flour on air one and turns out it's not flour <laughs> it's, it's something to add to the flour but do you say flour the, the same way you say flour anyways it didn't turn like proper brownies but they were still so good so so good oddly enough after the brownies I was so sick I felt horrible I think I caught a cold it was when the time the temperature was sorry the time the weather was changing so I felt very bad uh, good morning I feel like every time that I've uh, shown myself in this video I have a completely different hair which is true because I've been um, experimenting the past month as you can see I tried to do the whole um, what's her name? Oh, Narcissa Malfoy hairstyle. I've also been filming uh, bits and pieces of what I've been doing for the past few weeks, but I haven't really filmed something specific, so I just, it's just basically mesh. <laughs> I did this little piece the other day, um, and I posted, it's just uh, one of those old eye sliders that I used to make before. I haven't made one of these in a while, but it's already dry, as you can see. And I don't think I finished it, I want to add little things around too. Um, one of my Patreons, she sent me this photo, this beautiful photo of her and her fiance, and I painted them so it turned out like this. Um, and do you guys know, I think I've, I've said this a couple times, I never finished my art degree in Spain, in Madrid, and it's something like a little uh, that I feel like I really need to finish, even though it's very, very, um, it's a little pointless to have an art degree because you know how the art world works. Nobody's going to hire you since you will be your own boss if you want to be an artist. Um, it would be nice just to have, because I started it and I spent four years in Madrid and my parents spent also uh, money on me and I feel like it's something that I owe it to me and to them. Um, the thing is that I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to find how if I can do it online so I've been doing some research um, but that's that's pretty much it So, as you saw at the very beginning, this video is sponsored by Skillshare. Um, at this point, you probably know what it is, it's this amazing um, online learning community. And so for this video, I chose a class that is a little bit different, it's by Michelle B. And it's called Designing the Life That You Want and Four Exercises um, to Find Motivation and Clarity. And uh, you guys, this last month, specifically this last month, has been such a roller coaster of emotions. <laughs> and of course i didn't really record myself crying but let me tell you i had a lot of breakdowns um but i think that's also good that's the only way to to really grow and um um she had this little exercise to write down this sort of things that i didn't really um question before or i never really stopped to think of what i want from life what what makes me unhappy what makes me happy um and just have that conversation i guess because i'm always in my bubble um, sort of fake reality that I create which is fine but I feel like there will be no growth if I stay there 
so um, I'm already writing these things and questioning things that I usually don't it's very very good <laughs> and trust me guys I am a person that I get so comfy and I'm so scared of change of some change and and um and mistakes so I think this was just needed it's just like a I needed that slap on my face honestly um and um yeah I haven't really finished it yet but I'm honestly very very happy that I started it um and make me feel pretty pretty good actually so uh, for limited time if you click the link on my description box you can get a premium um, access and then after the um, trial is done it's less than ten dollars a month so feel free to check it out of course and you guys know that there's so many other classes if you're not interested in this one particularly because I know it was a little bit different it's not art related but you guys know that there's so many art related <laughs> if that's what you're looking for <laughs> But that's it. Um, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I will see you very, very soon, of course. And I hope you guys enjoyed um, this little vlog. I'll um, see you guys very, very soon, as always. And love you very much. Mm -hmm. Bye.